Hello YouTube, we're David and Joan Robinson, a British Filipino married couple from Lancashire in the UK. We enjoy entertaining and having friends and family over for barbecues, garden parties and drinks. And we always have a lot of fun. In 2019, our old wooden garage was literally falling apart and we had to replace it. We bought a concrete sectional garage and we took the opportunity to convert that into an entertaining space, our home garden bar. We used a local electrician to run the electric to the building and supply the plug sockets and a builder to do the insulation and the plastering. The bar top we bought online from a company which supplies kitchen countertops and they cut it to size for us. The bar stools we bought from Facebook Marketplace, they look nearly new but they were second hand, I believe they originally came from Ikea. The light fittings and Edison style light bulbs we bought from Ikea on a visit that we made. The disco lights and the PAR wash lights were purchased from Amazon and the other tables and chairs we managed to pick up from second hand shops very cheap. The speakers I already owned the amplifier and CD player were bought from a car boot. I think we paid £20 for the pair. We also have a karaoke system called Grand Videoki. It has about 8,000 songs on it. About half of them are Filipino songs as it was purchased from the Philippines. I'm filming this during autumn in the UK and I really need to rake up the leaves in the garden which I haven't got round to yet. The TV is a 49 inch smart TV from LG which I bought off Facebook Marketplace again and the beer fridge we bought from Amazon we already owned that before we built the bar uh, but we moved it into the bar from the house Some of the bottles that you can see have been given as gifts. Our friends have been quite generous in giving us bottles to help stock the bar. Some of them uh, obviously that we bought ourselves and some of them that we have brought back from holiday or we don't really know where some of them have come from, they just seem to turn up. We've uh, got some peanuts hanging on the wall that we purchased from Amazon. We have a nice range of bottles and spirits behind the bar now. One of the things we don't have is draft beer. Uh, that's something that's never really worried me. We just use cans in the fridge. Uh, one of the things I would like to have had done is fitting a sink inside the bar. At the moment we use the sink in the house for washing the glasses. That's something that maybe we'll do at a later date. The sign on the wall there was a gift from one of our friends. The fridge freezer again was a second hand item of Facebook Marketplace, we paid £30 for it and one of the main reasons I bought it is it was just the right size to fit under the bar top.
some of the beer towels and accessories were purchased from a shop called Lucky O'Malley's Pub Stuff which we found on Facebook which stocks pub items and it's perfect for helping to fit out your home bar. The LED strip lights that you can see running round the top of the wall are GoV RGBIC which stands for independently controlled strip lights which have the special effects that means that you can have more than one colour and uh, different special effects with the lights. One of the best tips I can give if you're planning on doing a project like this is to sketch it out beforehand and think carefully about how much space is needed for the back bar, for where you're going to store the glasses and for where people are going to sit and just give a lot of thought to the space around the bar. And just a couple of clips of some of the parties that we've had since we've had the bar and we've really enjoyed it and we've had great use out of it. Thank <laughs> you.